Alright, this morning we're going to be talking about how to query another database on the same server. And um, I bring this up because uh, so one of my friends asked this question the other day. And this actually was uh, in a job interview a couple of years back. I want to say it was about five years ago I was asked this question. So suppose you have a server. So let's first check the server name. And we have databases within the server. see and so we're on the database client marketing and we know that we have tables in client marketing but let's suppose that we want to query another database on or some of the tables on another in another database on a server without changing this use client marketing so we want to um, in other words, we could do it this way, except in the interview this would have been a no-no. We can use the database and then query the tables. But is there another way to do that? And of course, if you've seen a couple of previous videos, you know um, one of the ways you can do that is we can select star from, um, we can do the database name, then the schema name, and then of course, the table name. So this is a database name, this is a schema name, this is a table name. That's one way. Okay, and just approve, as you can see. And again, we're still under client marketing. That's in our scope. And uh, the next way, of course, which is similar, is, and you'll notice, and I'm going to show this example, we're looking at the same table, and it's on the DBO schema. So what we did here was did database and table. And we left out the schema, DBO. But in this database, there is actually another table. And it's not under the DBO schema. it doesn't realize that this table exists. So blocking temp table two. Now the reason why I highlight this example is something that it's just to note when you're when you're doing um, or when you're querying tables in other databases, if we were to select star from blocking dot dot table two, we're going to see an error implying that the object doesn't exist. So in other words, this is one way that we can do that database dot dot table name with a DBO schema this right here blocking dot temp dot table two um, when we do blocking dot dot table two it will act as if the object does not exist so um, those are just some notes if you've ever in ever in an interview and they ask you how do you query another database this is one of the ways in which you can do that just as a note um, if there's a linked server set up, uh, one thing just to let you know is you could do, and, and you'll notice the syntax is select star on from uh, database name dot schema name dot table name. Um, if you have a link server set up, it will be server name dot database name dot schema name dot table name. And so that's how you can query a table on another server, or of course you can query um, another table or a table on another database using that.